consider the Earth and a few tiny masses. In theory, there is a mutual gravitational attraction between each pair of masses. In practice, we are only concerned with the gravitational attraction exerted by the Earth, because these are the only forces that result in meaningful acceleration and motion. Look at the forces. Notice the common term gm over r squared. We are going to call this the gravitational field strength, denoted by small g. Now we can replace all the gmm over r squared with mg. Basically, we imagine that the Earth produces a gravitational field around it, and it's the field that exerts gravitational forces on all the masses sitting in it, causing them to undergo gravitational acceleration. Restricted to a localized region, such as the surface of the Earth, the Earth's gravitational field seems uniform, always downward, and the field strength is constant in magnitude. On an astronomical scale, the Earth's gravitational field is clearly non-uniform. It's directed radially inward, and the field strength weakens away from the Earth, according to the inverse square law.